and welcome back to another Wednesday Wisdom. I hope that your week is going good this far and hope that it just gets better. Um, I wanted to say that the bed made challenge is over, but that does not mean that you stop doing it. Um, just getting that month down. So if you've done it every single day for a month, congratulations. If not, then keep trying your best so you can, um, so you can try and get to that so you are always doing something that will make you happy throughout the day and that you get a, a challenge achieved. But um, enough of that, I just want to dive right into the quote for today. And our quote for today is, you always have the choice to be happy. Learn to understand the bumps in the road, grow from them, and stay positive. You always have the choice to be happy. Learn to understand the bumps in the road, grow from them, and stay positive. Uh, I think that this quote is really important because I have seen like a lot of people saying like I'm never gonna be happy I'm gonna be alone like all this stuff all the time but you're putting that negative energy into an action by even letting it be a thought so you saying that you're never gonna be happy ultimately results in you not being happy because you've already put that into your mind that that's not going to happen so you're putting negative thoughts and energies into your um being and into your mind so that's not going to happen um to me i think that if you are having a hard time and you're not maybe the happiest that you need to be saying to yourself like what can i do to make myself happy uh does that mean like going to get my hair done makes me happy painting my nails doing my makeup do something that you know makes you happy and then keep doing it and always remind yourself that you have the choice to be happy. That no one no one is taking happiness away from you except yourself. So if you're making situations um, kind of rob you of your joy and your happiness, then that's your choice. So you're making that a choice. I do believe that. Now, I know that people struggle with depression and things like that, which is completely different um, from this, but I also feel like this, if you do suffer from depression um, and other mental illnesses, I do believe that you telling yourself and feeding yourself positive energy will help you also get through that. Um, just, I know that for me, I always am telling myself if I'm having a hard time that I have the choice to be happy or I have the choice to make that affect me. So whatever situation, I have a choice to be angry, I have a choice to be happy, sad, I have that choice. So I think that we all need to remember that we do have a choice in happiness and that we should choose that. And I think that if you're not happy that you should see why and what's making you feel unhappy and try to get rid of that energy. Um, I also do think it's important to stay positive in those times and say like to yourself, I know I'm going through a hard time right now, but it's only that it's a hard time right now and it's not always going to be a hard time later on. Um, and I feel like, I always feel like I say this a lot in my videos, but I... I just think that it's really important for you to have a positive mindset and and when you are in that place that you're able to tell yourself because I strongly believe that when you say things and you put them out into the universe that sometimes they happen so if you want to be happy say like I just want to be happy I just want to be um you know I want to be happy and I just want to be able to really do my best and put that out there then that's what's going to happen because you're thinking that saying it and then eventually you would do it so if you want to be happy say i just want to be happy say it out loud and then push yourself to really get into things that make you happy if you have a friend group that is be not making you happy and they take that from you maybe it's time to find a new friend group um which i know is hard but i would rather be happy than to have friends that don't make me feel very good um so if that's a problem then find new group of friends if you aren't happy with the way that you're looking then as far as like oh gosh I think I'm fat I think this that or whatever you have a choice to change that so if you think that then hit the gym or start eating healthy and really start striving to be better than and whatever your goal is like 
start striving for that. If you don't like, I don't know, if you don't, if you don't like your clothes, well, then maybe take an extra shift at work so you can buy some other clothes that you like. I, I don't know. I mean, these are probably kind of silly excuses, but I'm just saying, like, you have a choice to make a difference or make a change in you. I do think that we um, tend to blame other people or want other people to find happiness, and I think that it starts in yourself. If you're not happy with yourself, then how are you happy having you know friendships with other people and things like that that's not fair because you're not necessarily happy with you so I think that's where it starts I basically think that this is what this quote is saying is that you have that choice to um to be happy and that you should start making it I also think that you have the choice to make things like affect you so if if something happens and let's say that it makes you really mad um, and makes you upset, you have the choice to be upset about it, um, which I know that's hard because sometimes if you're really upset, you're just like so upset that you don't know what to do, but you do have the choice to let that affect you. So I always am just wanting things to be positive. Um, yes, I get upset or yes, I'm sad. Sometimes I'm, you know, not super cheery about everything but I really sit down and kind of get myself into a positive state because I don't like that feeling of feeling like I'm being controlled by something else that someone did but it's my choice to feel that way if that makes sense so if you like I said if you obviously if you suffer from mental illnesses that's something that um you know is an actual condition but I do think that these tips can help with that I think that you being positive to yourself um, and for yourself is important so I think getting rid of certain things even if it's friends and I hate to say but even family members that are not maybe the best influence for you and maybe not making you happy it's okay to tell them that you need some space from them to to find some positivity because that's not fair to just always be you know upset maybe they say something to you um, maybe they make fun of you all the time and it really hurts your feelings it's okay to say that you just need a little space from them just so you can um you know kind of make sure that you're looking out for you but um, like I said, I these are just interpretations and these are just my opinions. So not everyone is going to probably agree with me, which is totally fine and totally accepted. I just, um, I'm just here to give my interpretation on the quotes and give you guys positive things. That's what I wanted to do for Wednesday Wisdoms. So for this quote, that's where I'm going to end it. I hope that you guys have a great day and remember to stay positive and to choose happiness because that is your choice. And I want to make sure that you guys comment down below um, and let me know your interpretations of it too. And don't forget to check out my Monday Makeup Madness because I have something very special on there. So I will make sure that I link that down below as well. But I hope that you guys have a great week and I'll see you next week. Wednesday. Bye.